Welcome back, everybody. Well, yeah, I guess I should. I never asked for this. God damn it, I'm an idiot. I'm always setting myself up for failure. How's it going, Seal? What's up, dude? Um, so I did a little offline farming, off-stream farming. I got my Crescent Katana, uh, but I don't have the stats to use it. Doing good, how are you? I'm good, man. You just missed it. We just played three hours of Escape from Tarkov, which is a decision I've made with my life, and I am enjoying it. But wow. I should really actually give the newer Deus Ex games a chance. Have you never played them? You've never played Human Revolution or Mankind Divided? Oh my god, I just tried to jump. X. Okay, we have the Ring of Avarice and the Ring of Magical Sharpness on. We do not have the Regen Ring on, which we actually want. So, which is the Fragrant Ring. I heard Tarkov just, like, takes over your life. Stayed away from it for that reason. Yeah, I don't feel that urge yet. I might. But I'm definitely enjoying it as an alternative to Hunt Showdown, because at least with Tarkov, the game seems to function properly. Although, that being said, I did die to a glitch today. One glitch. I played a little bit of Human Revolution, didn't grab me. OG Deus Ex is one of my favorite games of all time. So you're gonna hate me, but I've tried to play the original Deus Ex, and it just is not grabbing me. Uh, I need to, I mean, I definitely need to give it another shot sometime because I only played it once. Um, I love Human Revolution, but I recognize it for all of its ridiculous flaws. Like, it not really being an RPG when it comes to the dialogue choices. For starters. I wonder if I, should get, if I should do fire resistance before I jump all the way down here. Human Revolution was really good to me. I don't know why I enjoyed it so much. I mean, it's a solid game. The gameplay is amazing. It's got good stealth, good shooting, great fucking exploration like really top-notch exploration uh mankind divided is infinitely better he thinks i kill these little things don't you go nowhere damn it no stay next to each other so i can hit both of you Shit. Hey, Mullet, if I buy you a PlayStation gift card, would you use it for PlayStation Online? No. Don't buy me a PlayStation gift card. I appreciate the gesture, but I don't really care to give Sony much of my money unless it's for a PlayStation exclusive game. That makes sense. The OG one was so revolutionary for its time, but not special by today's standards. Right, and I recognize it was super revolutionary. Although you can definitely mod it up to improve graphics and such. That is one benefit that it has. I've heard that there are mods that basically make entirely new games out of it. A la no voice acting, but that's fine, right? Is this where I drop? Is there a lizard in here? There is. I think I'm gonna die trying to get to him, though. Oh, he's gonna get away. Yeah, he got away. Fuck. Oh, well. Yeah, dude. I mean, if you put them on your wish list on Steam Seal, uh, Mankind Divided, and uh, Human Revolution, dirt cheap. They go on sale all the time. I'm pretty sure I own them both, Humble... Oh, yeah, there you go. See, you already got them. All right, we need to fight the Flame Lurker. I own a lot of games. But do you own as many games as Monkey? Monkey. 
Monkey has like, I want to say 2,000 games. Which I don't know where really that really stands in ridiculous ownership of Steam games. But I mean, it's got to be up there, right? Oh, I can't have something on my tool belt and hotkeyed at the same time. 1208 according to Steam, not as much then. I might be wrong. I might, he may have just made up that number, but I'm pretty sure he's got a fuckload. All right, Flame Lurker time. God, that is a lot of games, dude. I wonder how many I have. Can't be more than like 300. Yeah, if I count all my console games, it instantly triple or quadruples my collection. Although, do you count games that you own twice for each copy you own? Because then I own like five copies of Resident Evil 4. Backwards? What the fuck? Oh, this arena is smaller than I remember. Quit dodging me. Why is he moving like that? Oh, I'm gonna die. He played me like a fiddle. Magic? Just gotta hit him a few more times. One more hit! Come on! Easy. Never worried. Well, are you gonna buy RE4 Remake? Oh, yes, dude. Absolutely. Ooh, 24,000. Probably at least like 500 from Humble Bundle. It's a bit hard to navigate my Steam library, to be honest. A ton of random garbage in it. Do you do you have your Steam library sorted, like into categories at all? Well, yeah, I'm gonna miss it, man. If you don't tell people <laughs> in the self promotion. I've done Sam category stuff. Yeah, I split my games in a PVP. PVE, survival horror, uh, single player. I might, I might do like action hack and slash as an option. All right, I'm not going down there. I don't want to deal with this fucking boss. I hate him. Oh, we got two level ups on us. I need to do that, but I have like 300 games and I am major lazy. Dude, just put on some wicked ass music and you got it, you know? Take you like 20 minutes. Mullet divides his by hentai, everything else. Hentai is a category in my Steam library. I've got like finished games, single player games to play, multiplayer games, party games, where it's annoying to source so many. Well, also, I, I just got me a Steam Deck uh, uh, right after Christmas. So I made a category just for like Steam Deck games. Um, or, you know, games that are ideal for the Steam Deck. Bravo, thank you. Let me buy him one. Ah, human potential. Yeah, I think we should get the fire spray. Let's get rid of Soul Arrow and do fire spray. Actually, hold on. Let's reorder those so the flame spells are next to each other. Wait. Square doesn't remove? Oh, X does. I haven't even used protect. 
Okay, Soul Ray. Fire Spray, Flame Toss. Protection. I think in total I have over 1,959 games on console. Holy shit, man. Don't ever take those to GameStop. They'll give you 20 cents. Am I the only person who could make a second Steam account for hentai games if I was into that kind of stuff? Seal, you can make Steam accounts for whatever reason you want, buddy. Because let me tell you, I don't have one Reddit account, I don't have one TikTok account, and you can figure out why. Some people unabashedly buy them on my Steam activity list is major. <laughs> hentai is a category in your library. I mean, it's not in yours? You got a secondary? Yeah, dude, have, have a secondary account for your hentai. That way you that way you're not tempted when you're browsing your regular games. Alright, what do we do now? We could do the Valley of Defilement, but fuck that place. Oh. Shit, do I level up my magic or do I level up my stats to use the katana? The katana. I need 18 strength. Man, I even have a secondary account on my Switch for hentai games. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? There's no fucking way Nintendo has anything close to a hentai game on their fucking platform. I do not believe that in the slightest. I do not have hentai in mind because kids also play on my account. That's fair. That, see, that's why you have a hentai account. Sakura Sakura. We could do the ritual path. Let's do the ritual path. How the fuck did we get on this topic, man? <laughs> I love how Seal framed it as, am I the only person that would make a second account if I was into that stuff? When I think of gaming on the go, I think of hentai. Oh my god. Oh, man. If they absolutely have hentai on Switch. What do you mean? I don't believe that. Oh, yeah, so you guys will notice that I am a woman in this game. But I accidentally swap. I swapped to a male at the end of last stream to apply uh, to wear different armor, and then I swapped back to female without changing my voice. So I sound like a gentleman, and that's just how we're gonna be rolling right now. That's fucking weak. Hey, you down there. Despawn all the enemies, please. Yeah, i never been my thing. I don't even watch anime. You don't even watch anime? You don't watch Cowboy Bebop? Or Trigon? Or Berserk? I will link you some games for future purchasing. All right, yeah, because I'm going to play Switch games on my Steam Deck. Bullet. You want me to stream those games? I can prove it. Do not stream hentai games, bro. You will get your account destroyed. I promise you. Yeah, Seal doesn't watch anime. Man, I, Seal, I thought you were cool, bro. What the fuck? Unknown warrior soul. Last anime I watched was like Pokemon when I was 13. Oh my god. Give it another chance. All right, we gotta open this big door here. Oh, we gotta go deal with- wait, I killed Patches! So he shouldn't be here to throw me into the pit. Now, I'm obviously way too non-nerdy to watch anime. I'm just an absolute lad. Right, you just play weird shit like Across the Obelisk, Outer Wilds, and Dead by Daylight. That's a fucking knight. That's the flute knight right there.
Yeah, there's no patches. God, fuck him. But would I survive that fall if I go down there on my own? Let's not find out. Because there's more to do over here first. There is a secret passage in one of these walls. I think it's this one. Yarp. With the red eyes, Skelly Boy. Oh, he's really close to me. I don't like that. Dude, he's got some HP. God damn, this game is so pretty to look at. No, what are you doing? Don't shoot me! Gonna eat some herb real quick. Are you close enough to kill? Damn it. I hate that they can target me, but they're too far away for my spells to reach. Oh, I did get him. Okay. Butthole. All right, I guess we're going this way. We're just going to have to dodge him. Ooh, but there's a... Fuck, man. Oh, don't fall off while attacking. Whoa, 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 wow! Oh, a white bow. All right, now let's go down into the basement. Hey, man. Hey, I took care of patches for you. Ray Robert Bilge. You know what, man? If you want me to buy your shit, maybe you should sell stuff that I need. Oh, I wonder what Blue Point is cooking up next. I think I think this was their last major game. Oh my god. I forgot about that trap there. What's funny is that trap was strong enough to kill me if it had hit me with all three arrows, and the item I just picked up to fall into the trap was a stone of ephemeral eyes, which would restore my humanity after I just died. Okay, you survived the- Ah! Wait a minute. The red phantom is not attacking me? What's going on here? Heavens. Well, I did the same. The I didn't fall for a trap. I jumped down here. To the outside. A fearsome dark phantom. But have no fear. Pray with me. Mbasa. No. I'd rather get kicked in the balls. You! You're supposed to dodge this. Oh my god. God damn it, internetting. What chat? What did you do to me? You, you did put the game on easy mode for me. There's got to be a way to make this more. I mean, I guess I can make it more difficult by not uh, wearing good armor. Should I just be? Yeah, there we go. Less defense. Just call me the Mad Mage. I 
the fuck am I? No armor? Are we speedrunning now? <laughs> Actually, Seal, if you check out a speedrun for this game, it's kind of crazy because their speedrun uses the PlayStation's... the PlayStation 5's, um... save state feature. And, like, they'll make a save state, they'll go over here and do a thing, the game will save, they'll load the save state, and it will keep the progress from where they just were, and they essentially use it to teleport around the game. It's kind of nuts. Dude, how do I get that? How do I get that? Oh, you know what? I bet you I need pure white world tendency to get that. Torch is very bright. Oh, there are so many of these things. Oh, no. Oh damn, yeah, I've watched some DS3 speedruns, so those are fun. Lots of completely breaking the physics and- OH WHAT THE SHIT, DUDE! Well, I just got what I asked for. I'm gonna fucking die now. Fucking armor back on. Yeah, all of the Dark Souls speedruns are very interesting to watch. The insane menuing people do. The out of bounds stuff. Whoops, wrong ability. my soul's at. Ah, my blood stain. And I don't know if I want to go out here. Yeah, let's let's put the armor back on for what it's worth. We need to kill some of these floating fuckers. But they're so far out there. I can't believe that guy rolled all the way up there and chased me. That was so evil. Hey, you! Come on, man. I can't. This isn't fair. I can't fight back. I can't lock on and I can't manually fire the spells. Oh, are you close enough to kill? No. Oh. Oh, this sucks. Well, I just died. And uh, let's use the Stone of Ephemeral Eyes so I have HP. You getting in close? You're not getting that close. Oh, we might be in luck here? No, we missed. <sighs> Alright, you. Let's go. Camera! Ah! Holy fuck, dude. <laughs> All 
All right, can I get some of them from here? Yeah, they recreated this game faithfully, even the fucking bad parts. Oh no. Oh fucking no. Nope. Nope. We're not doing this. You're gonna have to come all the way up here. You wanna fight me? I didn't mean to use that. They are! He is coming all the way up here. Can they not climb this? Oh, these ones don't roll, so maybe they can't get up here. Wow, they're worth a lot of money. I'm gonna fucking die now. Look at how far away they shoot me, man. Like, it's so far away you have no idea the projectile is even coming at you. These motherfuckers. Wow, why are these ones so strong? I need more mana. Lock on! Oh, I don't like this. I'm so close to leveling up. They come... Oh... God, you died from the fall. I kind of want to go back and level up. What the fuck? Wait. What? There's a mini you? I want to I want to get enough souls to level up twice and then bail because I really want to use my special magic katana. Oh god, you're invisible. Why is the game like this? I 
think this is another outside section with some more skelly boys, which means a lot of XP. I'm fucking walking through a wall here. No skeletons. God damn it, you motherfucker. Whoa, no! Bond behind me. Fuck, man. Can I use the Uchi Katana two handed? I can. All right, let's see how. Yeah, rip, dude. That was a real rip. All right. Let's uh, not use the stone just yet. See, I had to get away because that one guy's green laser attack goes through walls, and I knew that if he did that again and I fucked up, that was death. So I tried to run away to an area where he couldn't possibly do that. Nope. And I really don't want to die because that's like two and a half level ups I just dropped. Okay, fuck it. We're going to use the stone. I need that full health. Oh, jeez. Hey, you. Come up here. You piece of shit. So wait, you can't climb this? Aha! I get fucked! Oh my god, dude. This part of the game is such ass! I mean, I love it, but holy shit. Why they gotta do this to me? See, it'd be different if I could just kill these fucking things. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Hold on. I have a bow now. And I did just level up my decks. Maybe I have the stats to use the bow? Oh, hell no. I need 30 strength and 24 death. I can't even use the compound bow, dude. Never mind. That's out. All right, I guess I'm getting my ass handed to me because I was just complaining that you guys made the game too easy on me going mage. Well, now I'm getting my comeuppance for those words. God damn it. I was hoping to aggro one of them.
What do you mean, do I think it's worth it? You've played the game, dude. You have the answer with your own heart. Wow, this doesn't stun lock you. That's not good. Why are you doubting it? You've played the game. You know it's fucking great. Look at the game. It's fucking great. Oh. How much how big of a hard drive space do you have in your PlayStation? Man, dude, can you not this fucking attack. Stop it! Wait, I stun like the little ones. Okay, but not the big ones. Good to know. All right, we're going all in, everybody. Not much. When I sold my other PS5, my crazy butt uncle stole my Seagate hard drive and won't admit to it. Well, he's your uncle. Just go to his house and fucking steal it. Back. No skeleton here. All right, this is where I die! Did Miyazaki get better or worse at game design after Demon Souls? All right, where are my souls at? Okay, all is almost right with the world. Now, where's this asshole spawning behind me? Did they spawn? I think, yeah, here we go. They spawn from the pools. Oh, is this guy gonna spawn again? protection spell on us. Okay, I think we're done with the Reapers and the Ghosts. I think. Regret saying that. Okay, yeah, we are. Oh, man. Oh, they're dead. This is a very pretty area. This reminds me of something out of Metroid Prime. White slime. 
Everybody needs a reserve of sticky white slime at home. Oh! Can I hurt you with spells? Oh yeah, that fucks you. That fucks you up. I got the hilt list, the other katana. Yep, re-download. Oh my god, dude! Those silent but deadly bombs. They're not really silent. They are until they explode. They're all dead, right? Warzone 2.0, GTA 5, man. That's another game I'm getting really sick of hearing about. Like with Skyrim. How many times can we sell you the same fucking game? Oh, it's a great game. I just don't need to hear about it anymore. Not from you. Just the internet in general. Oh, I hate on Skyrim a lot. Skyrim is so fucking overrated. Even when it came out, dude, it wasn't as good as people thought it was. At least, that's my opinion. I have played it modded, and playing it modded is very nice, but you can't mod a video game and say, see, it was a good game all along, if it needs mods to be good, or to have new content. It doesn't work like that. Oh my god, the boss is right here? Oh, why don't we wait for Sky Oblivion mod to come out? Well, I'm sure Sky Oblivion will be amazing if it ever fucking comes out. Except, that's not, that's not Skyrim. That's a whole new game. Alright, what, what fucks this guy up in 2025? Hope it comes out in time for us to play it. Yeah, the new Elder Scrolls might be out before Sky Oblivion, man. And let me be very clear. I'm not shitting on any of the work the Sky Oblivion people are doing. I understand it's unpaid and unofficial, right? So they're working, it's basically a volunteer project that's crawling, crawling along at a snail's pace. That didn't even reach him. That did 186. That did 209. You are fucking huge. That's what she said. Ow, 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 ow. Get up. Oh, he hit me again. I'm gonna die. Oh, fuck. Bro. No, 
get away! Oh my god! Uh, please. Yeah, he's blind, but as soon as you shoot him, he's like, I know where you are. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, that ring. I open the menu, he's gonna fucking hit me. Thank you, Scarecrow. Holy shit. I only have two spice left. Man eaters, bro. No rod of magic. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, there was never a doubt in my mind that we were going to win. Are you talking about the illithids? In 3 1? Alright, let's go level up, man, so I can use this katana properly. You're good, dude. Ah. <sighs> Where's my maiden? Wrapped within touch, soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Soul of the lost, withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Boom. Twelve AM Bro, I have to go to work. I'm gonna have to be asleep at that time. Oh, that was what it said. Uh maybe pants. I told my buddy Selveron that I would play Neo with him on Tuesday and Thursday, which are my off stream days. But we shall see. But yes, I do want to play some Deep Rock sometime. I love that game. DRG. 12 a.m. to 6 p.m.? You're going to play for 18 hours, or am I reading that wrong? You're going to stream for 18 hours? Why would you do that to yourself? You just bought a copy. Sure. 
You're trying to con people into playing with you? That's not conning, that's called asking. Deep Rock Galactic, that's what DRG is. Hey, this guy! What happened to the other douchebag? Hmm. Heavenly miracles occur. God has it is God's way of telling us. Yes, I said that you must remember. Because you're chaotic. Uh, what do we do now? Let's go to Ed and see if he can upgrade anything for us. How do you not have enough room for a video game when you have four terabytes of storage, my guy? <laughs> On what? What can you possibly have taking up four terabytes of space? You're a troll, Scarecrow. You're a troll. I don't believe anything you say. Not anymore. All right, pants. Moonshade stone. Where do I get moonshade stone? To the Google. Dropped by Reaper. Dropped by Crystal Lizard in Shrine of Storms. Dropped by Crystal Lizard in Shrine of Storms. Can be bought from Grave Robber Builds for 3,000 each. have to kill the reaper to get this shit? Oh. Bro, how many hentai games do you play at once? Get rid of those. Oh, you know what? I want to upgrade the dragon sword because we're going to go to 5-1 soon. Dude, they're just uninstalling. It's not like you're getting rid of them forever. Kill the big guy in the sky? Yeah, let's go do that. They're your girlfriend's hentai games? Tell her to get her own computer, man. <laughs> Actually, maybe we go three, two. Yeah, let's go three, two and uh, get some spice. We're on a budget. Scarecrow, just because you uninstall a game does not mean you have to buy it again. Your budget doesn't matter if you've already bought it and installed it. Then why are you saying you're on a budget? Dude, this place is fucking scary. I mean, tell her to buy her own PC. There you go.
<laughs> See, that was easy. Wait, neither of you are alive? Oh, wow. Oh, but one of you is right here. All right, can I beat you up? Oh, yeah. I don't... I don't... I don't think you did. I don't believe you. <laughs> oh, yeah. This... Dude, this straight up is Bloodborne. Well, I also don't believe that because you just told me you were on a budget. Yo, how do I get up there? Whoa! What is it? You have a crossbow? Oh, somehow I dodged that. Oh, I almost fell off. One spice is worth it to me, baby. Got to drop the brain before I can go in there. Moonlight is not what I need. I need moon shade. Whoa, I almost knocked the body off. This atmosphere is stellar. Like, you could look to the right and see the clock tower from Bloodborne, and it would just be right at home. I don't believe that either. Where was it? Under your bed? Oh, hey, man. What's up? This is a Zweihander. No, it's a Flamburn. Whoops. <laughs> All right, man. Good luck. Thanks for hanging out, Corey. I'll say, I'll make sure I only say nice things about you.
Uh, I was just gonna say, where's the second gargoyle? Is he coming after me? Bro, just post pictures of it. On a selfie channel or something. Uh, no, can you not do that? Well, why does it say they won't post? Are your pictures too big in file size? No, no prayer anymore. Prayer is outlawed. Actually, you're not praying. I know what you're doing. You're casting a spell. Spells are outlawed. What's the file type? Oh, this doesn't go anywhere. Wait, what? But there's stairs over there, what? Maybe you don't actually end up going up there. Yeah, but is there, are they JPEGs? Are they PNGs? Are they TIFFs? What are you trying to upload? Because other people can upload stuff to my Discord, no problem. There should be no reason you can't. Oh, I need positive and world tendency. I did not know this. Yeah, Falcom, I love this area, though. Doesn't it look like Yarnum? How's it going, Yurt? Are you here to fight if That sounds like a problem to solve, dude. Help me escape this place. I am on your side. Oh yeah, we're killing him. I want to get souls! Because I'm evil! Now I go in his cage. Oh wait, this one doesn't... Oh, yeah, it does. Isn't that funny? When he's in it, it do... it's not an elevator, it's a cell. But when you get in it, it's just a transportation device. Oh, this part is great. Hope you like baby centipede demons. Wow, this katana slaps! This whole place is just gross. <laughs> hey, 
it's not a poison swamp. What the fuck? Oh, that's right. That's 5-1. Oh, hey, man. 63. <laughs> Look at that death. That is so cool. It's like they're being burned away by some kind of heavenly divine fire. A second fragrant ring. Oh, this is probably where you get it if you don't play as royalty from the get-go. Why are you making these sounds? Oh, wrong weapon. I was like, huh? Suddenly you have 20 times as much HP? Wow. That ring is gonna help me in the next area. Squeal for me. Uh-oh. Dude, that soul ray, the piercing ability, super, super good. Oh, that's right, there's more illithids around here. Back to fire. I think there's a red one here. Yeah, there's one on these stairs. He might be a red phantom. No! Oh my god. That didn't even stun me. That just straight up almost obliterated my ass. What the fuck, man? He's casting almost too fast for me. Yeah, give me a spice. I need all the spice from the dune mines. Dude, you had the jump on me and you couldn't even get it right. I just noticed their bodies stay here if you kill them with the sword, otherwise they evaporate. That's awesome. Yeah, come here. I don't want to upset the lizard. Nope. Oh, fuck. 
Blizzard's running. Come back, little one. Don't go down there. Oh, he's dead. No, now I'm gonna die. Nope, I spoke too soon. Okay, I think I can get down there. Oh, I go through the veins. That, that sounds gross as shit. Pure moonlight stone and a moonlight stone chunk. Well, if I ever need to use those. Gargoyles. What? What the fuck? You ambushing little shits. Yeah, line up for me, would you? Perfect. Too soon. Okay, that's an elevator. Oh, it just went up. Damn, that is a long ride. No hidden passage to the left or right, huh? Oh, fuck you. Are you... What the fuck, man? Imagine if this if this guy was like the brain in Bloodborne, and whenever you were within like a visible distance to him, he just exuded this terrorizing force that made you go insane and your ears bled. gonna go fight the man-eater? I mean, why not? Wait, what? Well, that's right. After the brain dies, you guys get really upset. You start coming all the way up here. How 
do I get that spice sitting on the ledge? That looks like a spin top. Ow! For a second I thought that was a grapple. What did he just spit? Oh my god, he almost chucked me off the edge. He got the fuck out of dodge. Wait a minute, are you for real? The fucking soul sucking ring that I bought for 50k is just sitting in this level? Fuck off. <sighs> One more illithid in our way, and I think we can fight the boss. I don't remember if the man eater is weak to soul energy or fire. to drop down from up here to get that item? Oh, I think I do! Holy snap. Oh, don't kill me! What the fuck?! How more carefully could I have slid off that ledge? What the fuck? Oh my god. What's up, Cervantes, man? Wait, did you see me die just now? Or did you miss it? Oh, dude. <laughs> I walked off a ledge as carefully as I could to not overshoot myself, and I fell on the edge of the following platform and then fell even further and died. I'm like, okay, how more care how much how much more careful could I have been? I'm gonna try and do it again here. Oh fuck off. Will you fucking Oh here she comes. Watch out boy, she'll swallow you up. Hey, so I played Tarkov for three hours today. Why does everybody hate that game so much? <laughs> I don't hate it yet. I'm actually really liking it. Yet is the key phrase. Where are my souls? Oh, over here. Do I have to do like a roll? And okay, here we go. Round two. Fight!
Really? <laughs> what? All right, I guess I'll just try rolling. Try finger butthole. Something tells me you played Tarkov, Cervantes, and it really rubbed you the wrong way. Very interesting game, but it requires a very large amount of time to learn and get good, like more than Hunt. Yeah, I mean, that's one of the reasons why I wanted to play it was because I wanted another complicated game to learn to kind of just sink my teeth into. All right, I think we're going to try rolling. Oh, that feels like a bad idea. Oh, what? Dude, this ledge. What am I doing wrong here? I also just really did not like the feel of it. I respect that it is pushing the Unity engine to its limits, but that hardcore of a Unity game hurts me. Yeah, I feel like there are some basic things that it could do to add. I don't understand why your dead teammates aren't allowed to spectate you. I don't understand why you're not allowed to have a kill view so you can understand where players are and, and where hiding places are so you know where you got shot from. Stuff like that is kind of bewildering to me. Um, I also don't like very much how is a scav. It's I don't like that you are punished by the merchants for killing other scavs because, well, it's hard to tell if a scav is going to fucking kill you or not. All right, here we go. Here's the ledge. Round four. We're just going to crack the knuckles, you know? Stretch a little. Oh, gonna gonna revisit that workout I did this morning. How the? Line up. Ready? Just. I don't get it, man. What am I doing wrong? I also don't know if there's an option in Tarkov to kind of say, okay, I give up, let's start over and like prestige in a sense, because I'm, I'm definitely dying more than I am getting out alive. So I am running out of money and gear. And I guess the equivalent to, you know, the option you have after that happens is, well, you better scav, but you can only scav once every 30 minutes, which I think I think there's a better system out there. I think maybe I think maybe like every time you go in as a scav within like a 12 hour period, the gear they give you should be less and less until you basically have like a pistol with one mag in it or something. So that way you can't just spawn as a scav and leave with the gear they give you. All right, what is this round 5, round 6? I don't even know anymore, man. This is so goofy. Like Is this what I'm supposed to do? Dodge off? There's no way! There's no way to get on that ledge! 
But there's an oh, there's an item on it. There's an item on it. And I'm gonna get it. Maybe I am falling from the wrong spot. can't go up here, can I? Oh, for a second there, I thought I was gonna do one of those, cli uh, you know, I was gonna climb on an invisible ledge. Do I have to go all the way around to the other side and there's another ledge? Is that what I have to do? that one I can no there's no way I can fall onto that that doesn't look right I see you up there Lulu see it almost looks like I could fall onto this one no that's too tight oh hey These guys look really dope. Oh, what, you want some too? Ow. Wait, are you telling me I jump from here? No way. I'm supposed to jump from over here, but there's a gap. It wasn't even far enough to kill me. There's just a death plane there. All right, this was funny the first five times game, but now we're on like attempt number seven or eight. You're driving me nuts. You're making me go hollow. What about if I fall on the other side? Oh, my souls are over here, shit. Yeah, that just straight up like isn't allowed. <laughs> Why? I wonder if even I got onto that ledge, if a death plane would trigger. All right, fuck it. Let's just go fight the boss.
thought I saw an item pop up. Your souls, warrior. And now I have my souls. I guess we'll just never know what that item is. Urgh. Oh, this guy's gonna fuck me up, actually. Do I use the stone and get back up to full health? Do I go back to human form? Maybe I just chop him up. You did not see me, like, at all there, man. Oh shit, there we go. Very, uh, very nice sparks when he dies. Oh god, is that gonna kill me if I fall? Let's not find out. Knowing this level, probably. Can you imagine how heavy these giant pots would be? What would you even store in these? Be way too much of a pain in the ass to get water in and out of them. And I'm thinking again too much. <laughs> there I go again. Let's use the stone. So we can dump the cling ring. Or... Fragrant ring? Did these guys burn me? I think they burned me. Okay. 
242. Okay. A little early on that. Oh, they poison. 306. Here's the way to do it. Okay, what the shit? That was very fast. Get away from me, bro. I gotta kill you before your friend shows up. Will you back the fuck off? He ducked right under my fireball. All right. Oh, fall to your death. Fuck. He almost made me fall to my death. Oh, he can't fall to his death, can he? He just straight up flies. Damn it, dude. Bites the back of his head. Is that an attack? Ugh, Hall and Oats. Fucking goddammit. First try, no problem, wasn't worried at all. Sorry, I'm not cool. I don't know. I don't know what popular songs are called. Moon Short Sword. Ooh. Ah. Oh, here she comes. Watch out, boy. She'll swallow you up. The 70s. That was like a hundred fucking years ago. All right, I'm done with this place. I don't want to fight the monk right now. Let's go fight the fucking sea stingrays, the sky stingrays. Uh, should we level up our HP? I'm kind of getting my ass handed to me. Let's do that. And intelligence. Okay, um... Yeah, I think we have everything we need to go fight, uh... Storm King? Is that what he's called in this one? Or is that what Yorm's nickname is? King of the Storms. Thank you. And if I remember right, you want to kill all of his minions and then get the sword. Is it Storm Ruler in this one too? And in Demon Souls 3? Dark Souls 3? No, he is the Storm King. What? <laughs> ah, fuck! Give me the Ring of Avarice, damn it. 
We're gonna get a lot of souls doing this. <laughs> Shrug. Cervantes, you were fucking wrong, man. I love the sounds these things make. Yeah, I'm gonna try that first. See, they put the sword in there so that way people who did not build their character like this can actually beat the encounter. <laughs> oh, I forgot about how many of these come flying at you. Oh yeah, you're fucking dead, dude. Aw, uh, he sounds like he's in so much pain. I'm sorry, buddy. What? I can't break that? Did they not do that in Demon Souls? Some of those will hit me. We might have him right here. Yeah. Wait, what? What? Did I just miss? I don't know why I got the katana out. Am I missing something? There we go. Yeah, I was barely missing him. All right, looting time. Ooh, and there's lizards out here. Have to come back for them though. Oh, mood sh moon shade stone, I need that, but I also need the regular. Oh, Jesus Christ. Your carrying capacity will be exceeded. <laughs> Little cubby over here with more stuff in it. I didn't mean to do that. What does a cloud stone upgrade? Oh, one of them died on the edge over there, but I can't get that item. place is called the monolith forest that sounds awesome but i don't know if i agree i don't think there are enough monoliths nearby to make it a forest thomas i got too much shit on me 
always wanted sick. Nexial Agent. Oh, now I can travel between levels. Cool. I thought I could already do that, but I guess not. <clears throat> this isn't EFT. I. Do you read the goddamn schedule? I started with e EFT, Corlin. What's up, man? How are you? We are in debt. I can forge weapons for you. Uh, we got some cool victories in today and some embarrassing deaths. I died from my first glitch. So that was fun. You come back alive. Oh, that was what he said. Dude, I want to wear different armor. What does the Imperial Spy look like? Definitely looks a little cooler. Uh, let's go back there and kill that other crystal lizard. Wait, are they back? Oh my God, they're back. For some reason I thought they were all gonna stay dead. No shit. Okay, you're invincible during that. Cool, 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 cool. Damn, they give you 2,000 souls? That's not a bad spot to farm. This is not a bad spot to farm. Proper English, mullet. Well, we're gonna do that a few times until I can kill those lizards. Because I think, yeah, they're giving me moon, moon shade stone. Congratulations, Scarecrow. I think the word you're looking for is ecstatic, my guy. I'm gonna get hit. This farming will be a little nice as a bonus to uh, the stones. No, 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 no. Come back, damn you. Oh, that's not going to stop him. Damn it.
dude, we're gonna do this a couple times. Holy shit. When I was seven, I could read and comprehend college level books. But you have trouble spelling? I mean, I guess that can be a thing. I was shit at spelling for a long time as a little kid. I don't think I got good at spelling until the seventh or eighth grade. But I'm great at it now. You're good at reading comprehension, but forming the words is like... Like there's some kind of weird fog there, right? Like a demonic fog. I just got two for one. Holy shit, how many times do I have to kill that lizard on the left? Let's kill the lizard on the right. He's got to have something good. Can't you run in the same spot? That'd be really nice, you guys. Hey, 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 come back. Don't you go off the ledge. Not that lucky. Well, I have enough souls. Maybe now I pay to have my voice changed back to female. Eventually, these crystal lizards stop spawning. I think they show up. I think they have one life per boss you've killed. Fuck you guys. What is that? Come on, how am I supposed to pick that up? I can pick up this one, can I? Oh! It kind of like moved the interactable over to the ledge for me. Hmm. I just missed him? What? Don't you taunt me, you little bastard. A pure Moonshade Stone. I'm gonna need that to get this katana all the way leveled up. gonna die why am I not casting at them damn it Oh my goodness.
fuck off! Jesus! Fuck it. We're going for the lizards. Oh, the left lizard is finally dead. So I only have to do this, what, four more times? For this poor guy? Probably go spend my spell, my souls and then come back here because if I fuck up, these guys are going to wipe me out. Wait, sometimes they give you 2,000? Sometimes they give you 1,600? What? Okay. More mana, please. Actually, more HP, please. I have five level ups from that. Holy shit. Did I just say give me HP? Nope, I just did I just did magic power and mana. <laughs> Alright, let's finish off this lizard and then we're gonna go get my crescent katana leveled up. Then we could go back to 4-3. Oh wait, that lizard is gone? Maybe they sh did they share lives? Okay, I guess we're done with the lizards. Let me give you a proper shout out. Super, am I spelling that right? Super Saiya. What is going on, everybody? Thank you so much for showing up. Super Saiyan Raid. I can already tell that you guys are an awesome bunch of people. Carl and I didn't realize you were still here. But thank you for being here. What's up, everybody? Welcome on in. My name is Mullet Wesker. I play a lot of, well, action games. I play a lot of Souls games. I play a lot of Resident Evil. I play a lot of Hunt Showdown. But lately, I've been playing From Software stuff. Uh, I beat Sekiro for the second time ever back in December. And then I had the itch to come play this. So here I am on my second playthrough of the remake, doing a mage build. How are you, everybody? It's Super Saiyan Girl, what were you playing? I'm assuming some kind of From Software game? What do I need to do now? Go talk to Ed. Super Saiyan Raid, dropping good energy. Feel it, take it. <laughs> Rubber Duck, C Page, the real Korra. Nice, Demon Souls on my first playthrough. No shit. Uh, original, or you're playing the remake? Uh-oh. That hurt. Does Bullet make a good mage? That's a tough one, the eight ball says. You're playing the remake, nice. This is really a one for one remake. I mean, they added a few quality of life things, but for the most part, it's the same game. This is like how you do a remake. How uh, how far are you? Oh, I don't have any mood chain, mood, moon shade stone shards, which means I have to go kill the Reaper a few times. Blah. Wait, the cloud stone is for the heater shield? Why? Were you able to escape from Tarkov tonight? I did a few times before we played Demon Souls. Yes, we played Escape from Tarkov for a few hours before tonight because that's become a recent obsession. I could not play the OG back then. It felt so bad for me, especially after Dark Souls 1 on PS3. Yeah, it's kind of hard to go back to. Um, Dark Souls, sorry, Demon Souls can feel really lean and kind of empty at times, but... Um, it's funny, I feel that way about Dark Souls. That's the one I go back to the least. 
But yeah, this remake, beautiful, sounds great, runs well. Load times are super, super short. But I really love the remake now. What uh, what kind of character build are you making? Or are you just kind of doing whatever? I have the right ring on. You! Give me your stone! Hey, alright, gotta do that three more times. I remember when I played the original of this, I had beaten it two or three times, and I don't know if it's still in the game, but in the original, there was an item duplication glitch. So you would find like one of the soul items or you'd beat the first boss and get their soul. And then you'd dupe it 99 times. And then you could just max level yourself before you did anything. You're doing a strength build. That's the way to do it. Make it tough. I, uh, I started over last Sunday and I asked chat, hey, what kind of character should I make? They told me to make a mage. So... I've kind of been put on easy mode by playing a mage build, but I'm kind of trying to do a glass cannon thing where I have very little armor. And I'm just maximizing my int and magic power. Dude, every single time I play an RPG, especially a From Software game, I'm always a strength build. I always go for the two-handed sword. I always go for the heavy set of knight armor. It always has to be my first playthrough like that. It just feels right. Does it really feel easier with magic? It does up to a point. Uh, a lot of enemies are weak to the soul arrow and soul ray. And there is a class you can start as called the royalty, which gives you the fragrant ring, which... What the fuck? I got shot. Um... If you start as the royalty, you can start the game with the Fragrant Ring, which slowly restores your mana over time. So there's that, which is a huge boon. And you start with spells that you otherwise would have to buy. I'm nodding along like I understand what you two are talking about. Well, Corlin, if you would just play a good video game once in your life, you know, you might be able to follow along. Uh, but then you get to other areas in this game and you're like wait hold on it's not easy mode anymore and my melee completely sucks because i focused magic strength dex is absolutely the way um wow dude hey thank you so much for the follow um what i like about demon souls though that the other souls games don't necessarily let you do is you can go to the region you want to out of the gate you know you can go to the kingdom you can go to the mines you can go to the tower of latria you can go to the storm of shrines or you can go to the valley so if you know what you're doing and you know where certain items are you can just kind of beeline it to the items you want to get and start your build pretty early so i've just been leveling magic and i've got a uh, a magic katana that uh, i was just farming that guy to get the stones i need for leveling that up don't you get jump scared from your own follower? I would jump out of my chair. Well, I've heard it like 500 odd times at least, you know? So uh, I also like to play a lot of horror games. So if anything can scare me, that's just a bonus for people in chat. You know, I think. I have a few sound alerts that are meant to be scary, so. All right, Crescent Ucha Katana level three. And now I need eight more moon shade stones, which means I have to farm the Reaper eight more times. But uh, dude, I don't really want to farm on stream because I feel like that gets boring. Yeah, I've got a couple creaky doors that can be activated with bits. I have a Silent Hill monster scream sound effect. Oh, hey, I can level up. Yeah, like that one, Corlin. You motherfucker. 
Oh my god, that was loud. Ow. And I just hit my elbow. These sound alerts were a bad idea. I'm turning them off. Maiden. It has level up, please. Thanks for the bits, Corlin. Uh, dude, I need to go buy some grass. Which is a sentence I do not say in person. You know what? We could do the Valley of Defilement. Although, god, dude, that place is awful. I don't Oh, no. Let's go do Boletaria 3-1-3. Uh, so, I don't know how much you care for spoilers, Super Saiyan girl, but... I am, uh, if you just started the game, I'm a ways ahead of you. So there will be some, uh, some areas you haven't been to yet that you'll see if you stick around. I stabbed you in the back. Fuck! All right, I'm heading off. It was nice to meet you. Have an awesome stream. Well, thank you so much. Thank you for sharing your community with me. I hope you and the rest of your community have a fantastic night, a fantastic start to your week. Oh, you were just writing that? Nice. Have a good night's sleep. Do what you gotta do. Get some water. Stay hydrated. You got a dog or a cat? Say hello. Give them pets. Oh, that's right. I killed this dragon. You also stay awesome. Alright, yeah. I don't want to go to the Valley of Defilement yet because just fuck that place. I hate it. So let us go to three, I keep saying three, one. Let's go to one, three. See if we can kill the boss here. Go get defiled, no dude. I would much prefer to level up my dragon uh, longsword first because those guys hate fire. Wait, is my world tendency black? Oh, it is. Yeah, okay, I did that last stream, I remember now. Just one dog? No, what the hell? Wow, did you see that dodge? I timed that. You're alive? Get out of here. Oh, this is where Yuria is. Need the key. I gotta save her, bro. I'm a mage. I need her special spells. Oh, look at this item. You guys were so slow. Damn, as soon as you hit him, he runs away. Wait, where does goons go? No, there's a lizard! Leave me alone! I gotta kill the lizard! Okay. No! Put that down. What are you guys doing? You okay there, buddy? Who just shot at me? I'm on a ladder. Fuck off. The way the human enemies scream, it's pretty awesome. Can't open that door. Oh, there's an assassin down here. I'm gonna die. Not dead. Yet. Oh, I could have rolled backwards into here. 
Also, Cervantes, go get defiled, man. I, we stream on Twitch. We're already defiled, man. We're, we've basically gone hollow is what we're doing with our lives, you know? Oh, you stupid assassin. You don't have a big brain. enough to one shot you. Maybe if I use my Chris Blade when I'm casting magic, I don't know why I'm not doing that. Oh, there's a red eyes knight there. I didn't forget about that. Oh my god. The archer interrupted my attack. What? Wow. Okay, he is fucking strong. Damn it. There goes another stone. Wait a minute. You don't even get half HP? Ugh. Hold on, hold on, shit. I gotta go turn my heat off. I'm actually baking alive right now. Yeah, Stone of Ephemeral Eyes. Dude, that sucks. Probably should have waited till I got my souls back to do that, but oh well. Now you guys are spread out. Huh! 
You did it again, bro. You no, know you're supposed to hit me with that. Hey, you're wearing my clothes, buddy. up there. Oh, let me get them all. I got two of them. Huh? Oh, there's another assassin. Wait a minute. I thought I had to go in the alley to make you spawn. What the fuck? Can we kill these archers before I deal with the knight? Damn it, I gotta be right on the fucking wall. Are they coming around? That's my ability. Hey, man. Wait a minute. I uh, hope you find something. To suit. Yeah, you still gr still sell grass for way too much. No, oh, what the. F I was transacting business, dude. Holy shit. All right. Oh, the king, perhaps that was really loud. Hard times, eh? In real life. Who else is trying to shoot me? Hey, you have no shield. Perfect. Ooh. Wait, you're not dead? That gets me to Yuria? What the? Oh. So these assassins are actually invisible. Well, they do something. Are you playing EFT right now? Oh, an item down there. 
not at the moment. Uh, Pants saved my life from a sniper, which was a really impressive shot from the distance we were at. And then she died to bleeding, but I was able to extract with my life. that sniper killed Hauser. Unfortunately. Oh, I'm hearing the dogs in those wagons down there. Okay. Good attack. What am I carrying that is so fucking heavy? Oh, a bunch of stones. Okay, that makes sense. That tracks! Whatever. Is there another red eyes knight. Oh, what the fuck was what? Whoa, God. Holy shit, they have resistance. protection and we'll fight them like normal whoa you, that really does, that doesn't hit your friend for real what the fuck This is not going to be a fair fight. I did not know these guys would spawn here if you have Black World Tendency. Oh my god, they have so much fucking hell. Kidding me, dude? That sucks. He was very quick to swap to his spellcasting animation. All right, we blah 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 blah. We are equipping the cling ring. It still is like sixty percent of my HP. What? Where's the dog? I think if you need something, I'm gonna go rummage through a few games. You got it, man. Oh no, the iron ring doesn't open that door. What the fuck do you open?
Ring of Iron Keys, they all look the same. Huh. You don't slay. Leave me alone. I just need the lizard. No! God damn it! Ah, uh, there goes my souls. Oh well, that was my fault. I got greedy. Actually, that wasn't even greedy. That was just me being stupid. Shit, man. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go to the Valley of Defilement. My health is still garbage for this place. All right. Let's see if I do more damage with my katana or the fire longsword to these guys. That was an accident. Okay, I want to hit them by two-handing this. What about one-handing it? Yep. Kill them in one hit with this. What about the dragon longsword? Does this also get affected by my magic stat? It does not. It just has a raw fire bonus. Okay, and you do not die in one hit to this, so... Not a light attack, anyway. Crescent Katana it is. Will be none of that. Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, I need to fall to a different area. I was like, this doesn't look very high up. How can I get to this other platform I just noticed? Oh, you're alive! Oh, damn it. I keep forgetting to send things back to the storeroom. Oh, this is a bad trap. Is it fire that you guys hate? I'm pretty sure it's fire. Go back up here and open the shortcut. I don't feel safe falling on that. Talisman of God. I don't need that. I got the Talisman of Beasts. Oh! Damn. Sleeping behind me. Game? Do not. <laughs> no! 
Oh god. this place although I think I actually prefer this place over uh, what is it what's the blight town I think I prefer this over blight town to be completely dead honest That's with a bunch of these assholes sitting here pretending to be asleep in grass who stab you in the back with poison daggers. Oh! The bloody boil room. Who I also kill in one hit. Alright. God, and they jump down and hide. Jump down from hiding to get behind you. Do I hear a crystal lizard? You there, won't you, please? That poor child is hungry. Bitch, you're trying to sell me full moon grass for 2,000? And ephemeral eyes for 30 grand? Are you, okay, your chain mail seems that rather feasible, but what the fuck? I should kill you. What does Black Soul Tendency look like in this place? Oh, this is Plague. We're gonna have the Plague Resistance ring on now. God, they're just slowly climbing up here at me. Can I just do this? Yeah! Yeehaw, dude. Fuck that. There is a crystal lizard over there. Wow, you get so little XP from these guys. Alright, we have a giant down here to deal with. Oh, fucking... There's three other dudes in here. Wow. What the? And another one falls from behind. Wow. Arrow stone chunk. What do you do? Are you for bleeding? Oh, there's another big guy. Fuck. And I didn't even hit him with that attack. Ray Fox! Some grass just ain't cheap, you know? Why does your character look like an elf? What do you mean? You talking the armor, or are you talking the glow? They're glowing because I'm a, I'm a phantom right now because I died and I lost my humanity. The armor is assassin armor I'm wearing. Is there not a motherfucker down here trying to kill me? I'm actually shocked. What's up with you, Ray, man? It's been a minute. Yes, I am a fan. You ever play the Souls games? 
Also, how are you doing, dude? What's life like right now for you? He doing an attack? Whoa, he just tried to shit at me. In Georgia? Wait, like the United States, Georgia? Oh, he got me, but he should be dead. I am a leech man! Drinking wine and eating Kim Kali. I don't know what Kim Kali is, but it sounds great, dude. Glad to hear you're doing well. Where are my souls at? 9,000? You're an ass. No, I mean the country Georgia that is in the mountains. Oh, you mean over in Europe. I didn't know there was a country named Georgia. Am I that dumb? Yeah, it's pretty chill here. Oh, snap. Oh, I'm still sad about those 25,000 souls I lost. But you know what? They were to new enemies, so I kind of deserve it. I thought there were more items around here. Am I dumb? There should be like five. 25,000 isn't that bad if you had fun. That's true. I did have much fun. Oh. The archstone of the leech manga demon, which leads to the swamp of sorrow. Going back to the Nexus. You playing any games lately? Or Tom. I was worried sick. Could go farm that Reaper some more. Can I upgrade the Chris Blade? I really want to do. Yes, Dwarf Fortress and Fallen Order also hunt sometime. You uh, you going to finish the event and hunt? We are in uh, Professor Jam has been playing the fuck out of Dwarf Fortress, dude. How are you liking the burning map? I love the burning map. Oh, also Fallen Order. I played through that earlier this year. Um, it was okay. I'm I'm excited for the second one. I just hope they improve the combat. Combat was just fine. Wait, do you sell Moonshade Stone? Did I read that right on the wiki? He does for three thousand a pop. Damn. Yeah, I think I'll probably will finish. Door Fortress is much better with the graphical upgrade. Yeah, I've heard that game has been around for quite a long time, but this is like the absolute definitive version of it. Does that one have the Ring of Magical Sharpness on? Yeah, the combat was mediocre. The other parts felt as if playing Laura Croft. Absolutely they did. Wow, I could have been collecting these stones the whole time I was farming this guy off stream. Home of a beach. You know what, while I'm there though, we'll take off the cling ring and we'll double our efforts. We'll use the ring of avarice to get bonus souls. And those guys give me, every time I kill the reaper, I get enough souls to buy a whole stone from grave robber bilge. So actually this won't take, it will take half as long combat was mediocre the other part felt yeah yeah 100 percent the exploration was i think the best part to me i just find it funny how jedi and video games are always doing like shit that's way more ridiculous than anything in the movies oh there's still a free version of war fortress even though they just made like five million off the paid version that's kind of sick that's awesome Oh, 
wondering, how many stones do we need? We need at least eight for the next level, but we might want to just go ahead and grab 16. <clears throat> and we could go to zone two, back to the mines, and farm all the dragon stones for the dragon longsword. I, uh, I've been playing through, well, I played through Sekiro last month. I finished the hunt event. I just started playing Escape from Tarkov back on Wednesday, dude. Today was the first time I played it for more than like an hour. And I'm really digging it. Yeah, the inspiration from Lara was right in the face, but they took all the good bits. The fighting, though, I don't know. They could do better. Yeah, the fighting feels like Souls Light. Uh, they need to let you parry every single blaster. Uh, laser blast that comes at you instead of one because that felt really awkward. I did not like that I'm also really sad that you can't chop off enemies limbs like They do it in the fucking movies guys. Let us just lop off arms, please I also find it really silly that creatures are able to use their natural claws and teeth to deflect your lightsaber. Like, what? No? Tarkov? Ooh, brother, that is like a whole new world. It is. It's completely different. I know why some people compare it to Hunt, but I honestly don't think the comparisons are really there. The only similarities are, oh, your guy died? Well, everything on him is gone. And like, it stops there. Even though Hunt really doesn't have gear fear. Tarkov has gear fear, dude. Like 100%. Although right now my inventory is so full, I'm kind of okay with dying because that means it frees me up to go scav and find new shit. Yeah, the creatures bothered me too. I couldn't feel that I need four hits to kill a rat. I mean, come on, it's a lightsaber, right? Yeah, I thought we were gonna fight like more Sith troopers. And uh, you know what the game didn't have? There were no vibro blades in it. Which is really odd considering in the Kotar games, you fight dudes with vibro blades all the time and there's like a lore reason that the vibro blades can stand up to the lightsabers, you know? So it's like, where, where was that shit during that whole game, huh? But it was still a pretty good game. Have you, uh, have you finished it? But that shit was lost, Tech. On the decline, ah. Dude, for being lost, Tech, you think somebody would be like, bro, this can block a lightsaber. We need to keep this around. I'm in the two thirds of it. Okay, I won't spoil it for you. I almost started talking about the ending because it's really awesome. My bad. Yeah. Yeah, I like the ending a lot. It was one of the best parts of the whole game. Whoops. Don't take a screenshot. How many stones do I have now? I have five. Okay, let's do this three more times. And then we'll buy a shitload from Bilge. Wonder if I can just jump straight down there and kill. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I use a stone of ephemeral eyes? How am I human again? I. What? I'm lost. I mean, I like it. And you have to acknowledge they had the balls to make a single player game in the age of games as a service. Yeah, I'm, dude, there's a shitload of people that still make single player games. It's just that it's EA, so it's kind of fucking incredible. That hurt, I'm gonna die. Oh, yep, I'm dead. All right, that's why I don't jump down there. Fucking gosh. Well, that's 45,000 souls on the line, so let's not fuck that up. 
Yep, with all the effective management. You know, I'm kind of surprised. I haven't heard EA being real shitty. You know, at least shitty enough to be newsworthy for a while. Mostly been Activision Blizzard as of late. Yes, it's sus that Blizzard took the lead. <laughs> or uh, Ubisoft. Holy shit, man. They had some stuff going on for a while, too, with their CEO just covering up so much sexual abuse. Ugh. All right, two more times. Yeah, Ubi's wrote that they can bankrupt, you heard? What? Ubisoft is going bankrupt? I'll look into that. I mean, that wouldn't surprise me. They've been making the same goddamn video game for years. And everything is turning into a half-assed, half-baked live service. I definitely just went to the wrong place. Um, are they still remaking Splinter Cell? Because that's like the only game they could possibly make that I would be like, yeah, here's my money. Yeah, effective management and its minus. Guess that wasn't effective. All right, let's go talk to Bilge. Actually, we don't need to leave. Let's go back up and talk to him. We don't need to evacuate, I mean. Winter Cell might be on hold. Skulls and Bones postponed again? And Good and Evil 2 is never coming out, man. Like, wow. That game is never coming out. I have 8. If I buy 16, that's 24. Well done, be sure not to get yourself killed. I'll do my best, Bilge. You just chill right here. Your empty sword scabbard. All right, now we go talk to Ed. Also, can we level up the crisp blade or the primal talisman? Talisman of beasts? What the fuck is this thing called? Yeah, well, what did we expect from AAA level game? Have you heard of any 4A games? Me neither. Oh my god. The closest thing I think to a 4A game might be Elden Ring, dude. Talisman of beasts. Just because of its sheer fucking size and content. Oh, it only goes up to six? Well, fuck, I farmed more than I needed to. Well, now it's max level, hell yeah. Dragon stone shards and chunks. So he can't upgrade the Chris blade. Each almighty weapons can own the highest grade of all as a pure all. All done. Yeah, Elden Ring won that game of the year and my heart. <laughs> I I love Elden Ring for the most part. I, I definitely think it has a few flaws that really irk me, but it's 
pretty fucking amazing what From Software achieved with that. And I agree that it earned Game of the Year. 1,000%. Where can I go to earn more stones? I think I have all the stones I can get from this place. You waiting for Skyrim in space? No, I have absolutely no interest in Starfield, dude. I've come to realize that Bethesda games, I they bore me very quickly. And uh, honestly, I think their best game they ever made was Oblivion. Skyrim, I'm tired of. Fallout 3, I never finished. I never finished Fallout 4. And I know they didn't make it themselves, but they never. I never finished New Vegas. Um, and after the Fallout 76 debacle and how fucking awful they handled that, like... I have no interest in Starfield. Do I hope it's a good game? I hope it's an amazing game for everybody who buys it and they love it. But I'm not going to be there for it. Not unless I hear some wildly insane shit about it. And it becomes like a, no, no, as a gamer, you have to try this. Yeah, Oblivion was good in retrospective. Absolutely, dude. <laughs> oh, I can fuck these guys up really good now. broke my guard um i know everyone loves morrowind but i could not get into it i it's it's too obtuse for me which is fine Ooh, backstab And I gotta do a lot of shit tomorrow. Not only do I have to go to work, I have to call a therapist to make an appointment. I have to call my electric company because for some reason my bill has shot up 220 fucking percent. I have to cook. And I have to stream Dead Space. And I need to go ahead and pre-order the remake. Are you gonna play the Dead Space remake, Ray? I wish for a game that has quests, text, and map like in The Elder Scrolls 3. Wait. Yeah, Tia, and lighter level and fighting mechanics like in Oblivion or Skyrim, that would be a perfect one. Ooh, a therapist. I bet it's because of Tarkov. No, I think it's just that I'm a 30-year-old person and more people should just have a fucking therapist. You know what I mean? It's more like I've been stuck at a job that I sit at for 45 hours a week and I hate it, and I'm struggling to find a better one, and I'm going fucking crazy, but I don't have enough money in reserves to just quit? Remake? Yeah, we'll check out for sure. Have you seen anything on the Dead Space remake, dude? Looks marvelous. All right, none of these guys dropped any dragon stones, so it's probably all down in the mines. Let me check these guys real quick, make sure I didn't miss a bag. And the lizards don't drop it, do they? I've seen it, I don't know why, but I have good hopes. I feel you with that therapist trope. Yeah. You just gotta have someone to just spill the beans and vent to. Yeah, I got all the stones up here. Look at this place, dude. I wish more of this level took place out here. Like, over at that thing, man. Ow. Oh, 
The Tunnel City. I think I'm gonna go kill that evil old lady shopkeep that oversells, overcharges. Ooh, crystal lizards are back. Yep, the venting and the help to get all the puzzle pieces clicked, because you as a person usually already have the answer, just not enough guts to say them aloud. Yeah, I just, I just feel like I'm at a point in my life where I'm fucking meandering, you know? Like, I don't feel like I'm building up towards anything. I don't feel like I'm making enough money to build up towards, like, a house. I'm not traveling, although I probably should. Streaming is nice, it's really fucking nice, but I'm not doing it full time. And I'm not really sure what else I can do to make myself do it full time besides save up the money and then take time off work and then actually just do it and see what happens, but who knows. You know what, let's go fight those red phantoms that I ran past earlier last time I was here. I bet they've got some shit. What the fuck? I thought I was far enough away. <laughs> hey, you motherfucker. Don't hit me. Yeah, same here. Actually, also have the stress because of the war that was... Yeah, dude, I, I fucking bet, man. That's why I asked how you were doing. And the feeling of that you won't have enough money for the house, but your parents had in your age, that kind of shit. Yep, that's... That is... You're, you're saying exactly what I'm thinking, dude. I mean, I've got savings. I could... I could, right now, quit my job, and with all of the money I have in my savings, not my 401k, but my other savings, I could not work for a whole year. But what am I gonna do for that whole year is the question. Am I gonna stream full time? Am I going to work on a personal project like make a video game? Am I gonna write books? I have no clue. Oh, you motherfuckers look evil. Ooh, I can fucking fuck you up though. Preferably both of you at the same time. What was I worried about? Clear stone chunk, ephemeral eyes. Ephemeral eyes, dragon stone chunk times three. Yep, I'm working on a small game. Didn't work for half a year because of those savings. You mean you worked on the game, you didn't work a 9 to 5 job in addition to the game. Motherfucker! Ah, oh, damn. I gotta come back down here. Holy snap. Yes. Got it. And here's the other thing, man. Let's say I quit for six months to half a year and I work on personal projects and by the end of them, I'm not making enough money to continue to support myself. Would my old job take me back? Because I have a feeling upper management would be like, no, fuck you. Like, that's, that's the feeling I get from them. You quit, bro. Sounds like a very close story to yours. Yeah, I could write books, I could full-time stream. Aw, oh, you look sad, Maiden. I could just travel, but then I'm literally burning more money. Aw, oh, this is gonna be a process. Take these guys out every time. Spawn back, run all the way down here, call the elevator, the elevator up, ride the elevator back down, run down the tunnel, 
Kill three or four of them. It won't, but you will have to look for something in that time. I mean, psychologically, it actually might help with your burnout and to get shit together, but it's risky. It is risky. I've thought about it. I keep telling myself I'll quit as soon as my boss does something worthy of quitting on the spot in front of his face, because he pisses us off all the time. Or, or if I can just dupe another company to let me do something similar, for an extra 10, 20, 30 grand, you know? I'm back here, lizard. But mine. Hey, wrong attack, buddy. Because, dude, if I could make another 10, 20 grand a year and put that shit away, boom, I could buy a house, no problem. I could take vacations and not worry about the cost. I'm not getting dragon stones out of these guys. I think for an extra 10, you might actually find. Yeah, I make. 59,000 right now, and if I could make 69,000, that would be dope. Oh, that was what he said. Because right now, I take home after taxes and medical and all that shit by uh, $3,600 a month, and I put like 1,200 of that away in savings. Just boom. High yield savings account, stocks, bonds, all that shit. But I need more. I need my money to grow. It's growing very slowly. The more you put it in there, the more it grows. More passive income, that's what I want. How do you do it? Do you sell shit on a store? Do you write some novels? Which I've done. You can buy them on Amazon, but they're not very good. Oh, I think that other lizard is dead. Yep, he's a goner. No respawn. Yeah, the growth point is always hard, but I begin to think that it's made like this everywhere just to make the pro the prol stay the proles. It's basically the caste system, but it's coded that we don't get it. Is uh, is a prole like a European slang term for just like a peasant or a commoner or what we are? Not rich people? Hey, I got four of them this time. Yeah, the, the working class. That's what I should have said. Hmm. Whoops, I did not mean to eat that. You know, I don't think I'm going to keep doing this because... Well, I'll do it one more time since I just spawned back here, but... I don't need any of those stones not for the build I'm going for so we'll do it one more time I need dragon stone which must be further down whoops wrong stone uh, which must wrong altar which must be further down in the mines I mean, I, uh, what kind of weapons are here? Oh, have you never played Demon Souls, man? Well, I've got a katana, and I upgraded the katana to be of a magic variety. 
So it does bonus damage that scales off my intelligence stat. And I cast spells. I'm kind of a katana-wielding mage. Nope, didn't play it. You played Kingsfield, though. Oh, shit, dude. You played the prequel. Kind of. Um... I mean, you've got short swords, long swords, spears, glaives, halberds, bow and arrows, daggers, great swords, katanas. Like, I have a dragon long sword, which just looks like a regular sword, but it does fire damage. There's the Murden hammer, which I don't use. The prequel to the prequel. I'm here. No, God, dude, I'm gonna have to come here so many times because these guys have a number of lives before they stop spawning. Katana Mage sounds very Elden Ring. Yeah, it is, absolutely. Whoa, wait a minute. There's a ledge here? What? But, that was silly. Uh, yes, I was a Katana Mage in Elden Ring. I got the Katana with that weapon art that shoots like a sonic blast like Link at full health. Pure Sharpstone and pure Hardstone. That's kind of sick. Um... But uh, the spells in this game are very fun and very effective, but they're very rudimentary compared to Elden Ring. There's like one-tenth the number of spells in this game. This, this was their first Souls game. You got Soul Arrow and Soul Ray, and then you got some Fireballs. You got some Rapid Fire Fireballs. Okay, hold on. We actually need to go back up and through a side tunnel, and then we'll go down to the fiery bits. Oh, you know what? I should have gotten that fire-resistant armor. Shit. I need that, actually. I need to go back to the Nexus. Son of a... Stop eating grass! That's me pressing the wrong button by accident. Yeah, understandable. How are the bosses? The bosses in this game are great. Some people will tell you they're too easy, and some of the bosses are too easy. Uh, but I like them. Um... I was There's uh, the good old From Software puzzle boss at the end of this mine level I'm at, which I haven't done yet. Uh, armor. I need the armor that's resistant to fire. Uh, I'll try and show you a boss here in a little bit. Are there multiplayer invaders? Yes! There are blue phantoms you can summon to help, and there are red phantoms that can invade you, um, just like a Souls game or Elden Ring. However, it's PlayStation only. It's on the PlayStation 5, so you need to pay for PlayStation Plus, which I'm not doing, so I'm not playing online. Boost high fire defense, burrower armor. Okay. There's no burrower helmet? Well, this doesn't look quite as cool. Oh, well, eh, it looks all right. All right, can I change my my voice back to lady? Wait, I don't have to. No, oh, I have to pay for it. Jesus Christ. Fine.
There we go. Why does that cost money every time I do it? I don't know. They had so much philosophy molded in the Demon Souls already. It's like they'd done 90% of the game and then just upgraded some minor things in the other souls. I meant design philosophy. Yeah, it can feel that way. Like, this is the game that had the death mechanic where you lose your souls if you don't recoup them. Um... I like the mana bar in this game. I'm actually really upset they got rid of it in Dark Souls 1 and 2. Thankfully, they brought it back for 3 and Elden Ring. Um, the co-op stuff remained. Wait a minute, what's my status? You're white. Wait a minute. Is my armor that heavy? Are you fucking kidding me? Alright, I guess I'm not gonna wear this armor until I get down below. Oh, that fucking sucks. <laughs> yeah, I'm not slow rolling, man. I'm weak. I am the squish. How did that not kill you, man? Um, the way this game plays, though, or progresses, is quite different. So instead of having one big interconnected world, like in Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3, where, where the levels are all kind of linked together, instead, the levels in this one are all split apart, and you warp to them through archstones in the hub world, which is called the Nexus. And uh, what I do like about the game, though, is that so they, they refer to the worlds with uh, numbers and dashes. So like world 1-1, one, one, world 1-2, one, 1-3, one, world 5-1, and so on, right? So I'm in 2-2 two, two right now. And what I like about this game is that after the tutorial level, which you can skip, uh, you can go to any world you want. You can go straight to world 5-1 or 4-1 and go get some really awesome items that are waiting for you. But if you play Dark Souls, you can go to the Tomb of the Giants or you can go to the Castle Town, and that's about it. And funny enough, in this game, you don't even need to kill all the bosses to get to the end of the game. You need to kill one of the Archdemons at the end of one of the levels, and then you go back to World 1, and uh, that allows you to progress to the end game bosses. So they do some cool shit. Ooh, there's a lizard down there. Am I falling down this? Oh, fucking piss. This might hurt. Oh, no, it won't be that bad. I was way under leveled the last time I was here. Yeah, sounds good. Probably physical limitations with the hardware at the time. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I bet. Also, the locations just don't make any sense to be near each other. Because you've got these big magma mines in a volcano with a dragon god sleeping inside of it. And then you have a town. Then you have the, the swamp level, the Valley of Defilement. That's full of poison and fire-wielding uh, cavemen. Oh, you're not dead. No, are you running away? You can't run away. Give me that. The crystal lizards are in this game, just like in the other Souls games. Do you sell different stuff over here, you madman? Let's say that's all you fucking sell. Hard stone, sharp stone, clear stone, dragon stone, shard. What do I hear? What do I hear? Oh my god. What the hell are all you doing? Oh, 
You know, you can fly over the fence and get within attacking range. That would make this a lot easier, you guys. He's under me. Ooh. So this guy appears in two places, but he only sells the Dragonstone shards I want in this place, which is way out of the fucking way. How nice is that? Ooh, I have Black Tenancy. Does that mean there's going to be more phantom enemies? This is actually imitation of serving beer to customers in a bar on a Friday. Damn, they just, what, don't want to take it from you? Well, they're trying to take it before you can finish pouring it. Also, this game has a mechanic that none of the other Souls games do, which makes me sad because I think they could have reworked it. There's a world tendency mechanic. So if we look here, each of the five levels have an icon under them that is dark or light or kind of in the middle. And based on your world tendency being black or pure, uh, you'll fight more enemies and the enemies that are there will be stronger. Some items will be available to you or blocked off. Some red phantoms will show up that normally would not be there. Ow. In Bloodborne, what do you mean? I fucking love Bloodborne and I don't know what you're talking about. But you get deeper into madness. Oh, the insight. Yeah, it's it's different though because the tendency goes back and forth in this game. Whereas, well, I guess I can go back and forth in Bloodborne if you keep losing insight. But the more you gain, the crazier you get. Wow, you have a lot of health. Some Lovecraftian shit. Oh, dude, Bloodborne is amazing. I am a Bloodborne stan, eagerly awaiting the day we can play it on a PC or the day it gets a PS5 port by Bluepoint Games, just like this one. Crystal Lizards! These have Dragonstone shards, man. Nope. Nope. You fucking bastards. You didn't even drop an item, you sack of shit. You know what? We need to use a stone here and go back to human because I'm going to need all the HP to survive this fire shit. Yeah, follow me, assholes. I mean, I definitely want Bloodborne to come to PC with 60 FPS and ray tracing. But if it's not going to, I'll at least take a PlayStation 5 port. Or a remaster or a remake. You know what? I gotta put the fire armor on. That's why I, uh, this room is why I picked it up. And we need to put the ring of fire resistance on. What is my fire resistance with all this on? 8094? Nice. Whoa! I forgot that he could jump. That hurt a fucking lot. I think it can be done because they even tried and did 60 FPS with mods. Yeah, isn't there like, uh, if you have a jailbroken PS4 or something, there's like a, a way to get it to run better? You quit jumping? 
Oh my god. I have to run around in the lava to get these items. Why are you doing that attack? What's up, farmer? How are you, man? Just farming over here, dude. Exotic. I wonder if the def the protection spell will help me. Only effective against physical attacks. No, it will not. All right, here goes nothing. No, 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 no! Holy shit, dude! Look at my health! Wow. I feel very lucky right now. Oh wait, we don't need the fucking cling ring. I'm not a stupid phantom anymore. Another big fucker over there. Come on. How's your weekend, farmer? Good, man. I was a little too busy. I almost wish I had more of nothing to do. As usual, I did a lot and don't feel like I did enough! Because my brain... doesn't know how to shut up. Oh my god, fire! I need to try something. Nope, 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 nope. That's not a platform. Okay, that hurts. Uh, that one might kill me. Oh my god, it's all slow rolling.
Fuck. Holy shit. Sholly shit. Now where else can I go to get these? I can buy some for 3,000 a pop and I have two chunks. Didn't blow up? Okay. Oh, I'm lost. Where is the flame lurker's lair so I can teleport out of here? You can't get to it this way, can you? You have to drop down, I think. into, um, you have to drop down from a different way. Oh, there's an item over there. Shit. Wait, why am I still slow rolling? Oh, I'm not. Ugh. I'm lost! Well, I think I got all the stones I'm gonna get out of this place. Well, actually, I would like to go back and talk to that merchant one more time. Use my soul-gathering items and just buy a shitload from him. I think I'm gonna need 24. Is that not detonating? Okay, this is the way out. Can you not get to the flame lurker through here? I thought this was like the main way to get there. Hey, buddy. You're not really my buddy, you're fucking creepy. Seven. I need to buy way more. Wait, why are you back? Oh, you're down there. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. I can't buy more because they'll exceed my carrying limit. Oh, that's one thing they should have gotten rid of in this game. Just... Oh, I like the idea that you can send stuff to the storage shed, which I don't remember if that was in the original. But why is there even an item carry limit? Can you imagine if Elden Ring had that? I was what he said. We are in danger. All right, let's go see what I can upgrade with Ed. <sighs> there would be plenty of joy. No much joy, man. No much joy in the world. Do you sell me that shit now? Nope, I have to go down. You know what? I think he sells me the stones anywhere he is after I kill the dragon god. But fuck that guy. He's an asshole. I don't want to deal with him. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't need that many. <laughs> I do need one more pure dragon stone, though, which I get from the boss, I believe. I don't think there's a point in upgrading this shield, because I'm not going to use it to attack. And it doesn't defend better or have more durability if I level it up, so... You know what I'm surprised they never added to the Souls games was the ability to sheath your fucking weapon. That would have been so cool. Alright, now we can move again. I could go fight the monk. Actually, it's 9.44, so I should probably just end stream, ladies and gentlemen. Which I think I'm going to do. Thank you so much for hanging out, guys. Tomorrow, I'll be streaming Dead Space again at 7 o'clock in the evening. Or Dead Space Story Time. We're only going to play about three chapters. Um, I think we're on chapter 8 of 12, so we'll do 8, 9, 10 for a moment. What? Because you just got here? Sorry, man. Not my fault it took you forever. Just kidding. Let's see. My brother is playing Elden Ring. Holden Out is playing Sekiro. Taco Kitten is playing Sekiro. Stanford is playing Armored Core. Where should we go? Holden Out has one viewer, dude. Let's go hang out with Holden. Holden is a huge Bloodborne stan. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow for more Dead Space. Take it easy. Have a fantastic start to your week. Don't let it get to you. Punch it in the balls. All that good stuff. See ya.